What's going on guys, it's your boy Joe. We're back with another video again today. Today we're going to be going over the top five mods you should do to your G35 to transform it to look at least somewhat decent or to look amazing. So like I say in every video guys, let's go ahead and get straight into it. What's a G video without a cold startup? Let's go ahead and give y'all a cold startup real quick. I'm sorry about the wind noise, by the way, guys. super super dirty today super dirty maybe we'll go get her washed these rims are for sale so if anybody's interested these rims are for sale they're wet glosses so hit me up on instagram right here or follow me on instagram if you support the channel and all that make sure y'all guys hit me up if y'all guys want the wheels i'm looking into getting different wheels now guys i got truck content coming really really soon this is the rod's truck if no one knows who the rod is I'll leave his Instagram right here. So if y'all guys want to see some truck content, go hit them up and ask and tell them, let's see some truck content. Let's get them to go and straight send it all out on this truck because this is a brand new 2020 Chevy Silverado truck. And I'm sure a lot of people out there like truck content. So we're going to go ahead and let out some truck content for y'all guys. And also maybe some 32 content. So yeah, guys. now we're making a quick little stop got to pick up some oil for the G because if guys if you don't know or some of y'all may not know or some of y'all are in the market for a G G's love oil they love oh my god it's crazy how much oil these G's waste or actually use up all right guys we just picked up our oil we're just gonna top off some of the oil guys in the meantime because we were missing some courts, I haven't had the time to go and just full out, you know. All right, guys, I'm kind of not used to doing this stuff in public with the camera because people be staring at me weird. I already tried already and because I'm at a park and it's really, really packed right now. So, guys, I'm going to go ahead and say it from in here, but I'm going to give you all some shots from the outside so you all can get a gist of what I'm talking about. I'm, I'm going to talk about the top five mods you should do to transform your g35 coming in at number five guys we got coilovers aka suspension suspension has a lot to do with what your like the way your car like whenever you hit bumps and all that stuff and how low and how high you can go if you get coilovers so in my opinion i like coilovers more than bags because on bags you ain't got to worry about a bag popping on you but then again you got to worry about being static and being too low and scraping on everything but either way guys i'm a static boy and i'm leaning over more towards static boy compared to bag boy even though i have no problem with anybody that has bags or coilovers i like them both the same but i prefer coilovers over bags but yeah guys guys that will help your car coilovers or bags will help your car get that lowness and look super clean and look like a complete different car instead of looking like other kind of cars like just like monster trucks in my opinion but yeah guys i high key recommend you get coilovers and then on top of that this leads me to number four number four you want to get is rims that's what you want to get is rims whether they're three piece deep dish i like three piece deep dish wheels but in general you put some nice wheels with bags or coilovers and you get that lowness with the wheels oh my god you're gonna look completely different even on stock wheels guys even on stock wheels the car looks different with with new suspension guys so make sure y'all go with the right suspension so i can get super low that's coming from a static boy guys you don't have to be super low but um yeah 
you guys want to look low and clean i recommend y'all do suspension on top of that get some wheels some really nice three-piece wheels or maybe just some regular wheels guys it, everybody has their own personal preference and so yeah guys that's two things right there already that you should do to your g35 to transform it into a complete different car all right coming in at number three i recommend people go and get their windows tinted that's right guys get your windows tinted it makes your car look completely different with that super super dark tint that super dark tint makes your car look makes it look really really good and just in case you know there's anything going on you know what i mean all jokes aside guys window tint makes your car look way better it's not so clear where everybody can see through and all that stuff so i recommend you get window tint and it also gets very very hot i'm not sure about everybody else's cars but it does get very hot inside texas and everybody's car so a lot of people rock window tint out here and yeah guys in general it just makes your car look really good it makes it look like a complete different car compared to being like super see-through kind of tint so yeah guys that would be in number three would be tint all right guys coming in at number two you got headlights headlights change up the game a lot some of y'all guys may not know this but i have spec d tuning headlights the ones that look kind of like check marks yeah so those look really really nice in my opinion it has the extra a little effects you can do with, with the side whenever you're turning and all that the signal lights in my opinion i really really like them and it makes the car look completely different compared to stocks even though i have nothing against stocks stocks still look clean with some eyelids with some nice eyelids on it it will look it'll look mint regardless guys even if you can't get that I recommend you get the eyelids try that out it will make your car look a lot better with some nice headlights some nice new headlights or the eyelids either one of those guys will make your car look completely different so i highly recommend those and coming in at number one number one guys i recommend y'all get a front lip and maybe some side skirts or a body kit those make your g look completely different and it knocks it out of the park i currently am running kbd side skirts with some random side splitters i just got off of ebay that are carbon fiber but it does it doesn't look that bad but yeah guys y'all should try that out and get a front lip the front lip makes changes up the whole entire front of your car makes it look a lot lower makes it look more aggressive because stock bumpers don't really look so aggressive in my opinion no no hate towards anybody out there just rocking their stock bumper by itself or you get a new brand new front bumper like the nismo bumper or the gt3 bumper those bumpers will make your car look so much nicer i've been thinking about getting the gt3 bumper right here i'll leave a picture right here for y'all guys yeah guys the gt3 bumper is so clean so sleek and super aggressive so i might be getting that in the near future and the side skirts and everything guys the side skirts make your car look a lot lower and the side splitters on top of that will make it look even lower than that but yeah guys i recommend y'all get a body kit there's plenty of body kits out there for your g there's wide body there is a uh, regular kbd side skirts there's different kinds of things out there guys it's unbelievable how many parts they make for g's out there and you can get either one of those so you got a variety to pick from so yeah guys i recommend y'all get look into those and it will basically transform your g all right guys i also found one of these my steering wheel has been fading a little bit as you can see it's faded a good amount so we're gonna go ahead and put this bad baby on there in the meantime it looks like kind of like carbon fibers if anybody is wondering where i got it got it from walmart but this is just in the meantime guys i know a lot of people are gonna say that's kind of rice but it don't really matter in my opinion i've seen someone else on youtube with a g have this on his g and it looks pretty clean check out this magic real quick and just like that guys we got it on there i still gotta line it up a little bit it's not directly in the middle but yeah guys we got that bad baby on there now and that's how it looks if y'all guys are wondering where i got it got it from walmart so yeah if y'all guys go and do those top five things to your g first i promise you your g's gonna be looking voila 
So yeah, guys, if anybody is in the market looking for a G, I highly recommend you get one. You can customize them to however you want to do it. There's plenty of parts out there. There's plenty of wheels out there. There's plenty of suspension. Everything is said, guys. Make sure, guys, go do that. And I promise you, your car will be completely, completely different, guys. Completely. No cap. But yeah, guys, those are the top five things you should do to transform your G35. If y'all guys enjoyed that little video right there, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And we're out here, baby. Peace.